It's time to check in with Approved Home Pros. If you're remodeling your pool, one of the issues that can come to light is modeling. Today, Mark from Gardner Outdoor and Pool Remodeling is here to help us understand what modeling is, and it's something I just learned about. What is modeling? Well, first of all, modeling looks like a cloudy day inside your pool. It'll have light and dark patches. And the reason why it's happening is because you're adding dye to plaster or quartz. And dye will cure, or the, the finish will cure at a different rate, depending on how the sun is hitting the pool, how fast it's filling up with water, and it will make it look uneven. Just like any sidewalk in the world, if you look at it closely, you will see that there's modeling going on. So that's just a natural outcome from adding dye to plaster? Yes. It also quartz, does that happen yes. with quartz as well? So also quartz. any of those, those uh, materials will have a natural modeling process, and it, is there any way to avoid it? Don't add dye, or move up to um, a material like aggregate finish, rock finish. So neither of those will have, or not a noticeable amount really? Right. Uh, is modeling something that you really have to be aware of when you're going into the remodel process? Do, how do you help clients understand that? You, you try to explain it, but people don't really get it until they see a picture or they go visit a pool. So the best thing is to really expose them to what a model pool can look like. It can be very light modeling or heavy modeling, depending on the choices they make, too. But there's not a lot of ways to predict that, though, right? No, it's impossible to predict. Okay, so in, how do you educate people about that? You, you said you show them pictures and you, and you have them. Uh, what, 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 how do you guide them through that process? We actually have a form where we have pictures of pools on it that they have to look at and actually sign off. So they really are informed of their choice. Now, have you seen people be disappointed because of the modeling and, and maybe think they after that they could have gone with, a, with an aggregate finish? Is that one of the ways that you would go yes. personally? I would never do dye in plaster or quartz. And yes, people do get disappointed. Even though you try to inform them, they are surprised by the ultimate look. I'm sure there are companies out there that don't really educate people about this because they're afraid of losing the, the, the job. Yes, that's true. But it's not a service to the client when you do that. They have to be informed so they can make good choices. Yeah, a, a, an informed um, client is the best kind of client, and that's what you do at Gardner Pool and Outdoor Remodeling. You really help people understand it. If issues arise, they're going to take care of it. You can find Gardner Remodeling at ApprovedHomePros.com. That's ApprovedHomePros.com.